I'm Ebony North for Investment Pitch Media. Thanks for joining us today. Netramark Holdings is one of the latest new listings on the Canadian Securities Exchange, trading under the symbol AIAI, having previously traded as Neurocene Health. This new name comes from Netramark Corp., its wholly owned subsidiary acquired in October 2021. George Achilleo, CEO, stated, This is reflective of the strategic shift that has been unfolding at our company and is a clear demonstration to our shareholders of our commitment to our corporate vision. It is our intent to be a leader in the development of artificial intelligence machine learning solutions targeted at the pharmaceutical industry. This is an important time for AI, and there is a clear opportunity in the pharmaceutical industry as outlined below. From drug discovery through to FDA approval, developing a new medicine takes, on average, 10 to 15 years and costs approximately 2.6 billion U.S. dollars. With less than 12% of the candidate medicines successfully making it through the clinical trial process and receiving FDA approval. One challenge facing the pharmaceutical industry is the inability to apply AI methods to small data sets and extract statistical significant insights that can be used to enrich future studies as 95% of trials have less than 1,000 participants. Netramark, founded in 2016 by Dr. Joseph Geraci to address the current gaps in the pharmaceutical industry, has developed proprietary algorithms that can change the way AI is used in this industry. Following more than five years of development, the company launched Netra AI, a novel topology-based algorithm that has the ability to parse patient datasets into subsets of people that are strongly related according to several variables simultaneously. This allows Netramark to use a variety of machine learning methods, depending on the character and size of the data, to transform the data into powerfully intelligent data that activates traditional AI ML methods. The result is that Netramark can work with much smaller datasets and accurately segment diseases into different types, as well as accurately classify patients for sensitivity to drugs and or efficacy of treatment. Josh Spiegel, president, added, I am excited about our capabilities to have a meaningful impact on an industry that our team has been a part of for many years. The name change certainly reflects the work we have done to develop Netra AI a unique machine learning system that provides an intuitive interface for scientists to interact with multimodal small data sets to uncover connections related to efficacy, toxicity, and placebo response. Bruce Campbell, President and Portfolio Manager of Stonecastle Investment Management, has joined us today to give us some insight into Netramark and why it has a place in his portfolio. Welcome, Bruce. Yeah, thank you, Ebony. We, uh, we're very interested in this AI space as is uh, as is the world really, you know this uh, chat GBT and Microsoft's uh, investment has really brought that to the forefront. And now investors are looking for areas to invest. And one of the ones that we found we identified uh, a while ago was this company called Neurocene, which is changing its name to Netramark. And what uh, what Netramark does is they have an AI technology to help with drug companies in the uh, in the trial process and. Really, there's kind of two two different ways that AI is used in that uh, that industry. One is for molecule discovery, and that's not what Netramark's doing. The other is uh, what Netramark's really uh, focused on is trial design, and helping these drug companies to design trials that have the the most uh, probability of success by by selecting the proper patients for that trial. So those those people will have certain. Uh, Genetic markers that uh, that will make it most successful for the drug company to to prove out their uh, how their drug works. The interesting thing with Netramark is that they were able to do this with very small databases. Most AI requires larger databases, but um, in Netramark's case, they um, they can use smaller databases. Now, the way that their uh, that their model works is that they'll get paid an upfront fee from these these companies. And then uh, they'll also get a progress payment along the way as they hit certain uh, milestones in their trial design. I think there's something like $80 billion worth of uh, ongoing trials right now. So you can see that the, the opportunity set is, is massive out there. We've owned, um, we've owned Neurocene for quite some time now, a little, uh, a little over a year and a half. And um, it's been a little bit on the painful side as the stocks dropped. But recently, the stock started to uh, to rally again as uh, there's been more focus on AI, and then the company's also been uh, more active with uh, press releases as far as 
uh, who they've been working with and, and the areas that they're moving on to. So hopefully that uh, gives you a little insight into what we, uh, what, what we like about Neurocene. Thank you, Bruce. The shares are currently trading at 40 cents. For more information, please visit the company's website at neurocene.com or email investors at neurocene.com. I'm Ebony North for Investment Pitch Media.